Hello, today I will be guiding you through a few tricks that will help you prepare for the OSSLT, specifically a short writing tasks and multiple choice grammar questions. But we'll start with short writing. To get a better understanding, I will explain what exactly a short writing task is. They assume the form of an opinion question, where you will be given a few lines in which you will write your answer. Here I have some important things to make sure of when writing a short writing task. PPC, also known as point proof comment, when writing your answer, you should always make sure that it is in this format for full marks. Brainstorm. You will be given space below your question to write whatever you think will help you with your answer. Make sure to lie in your answer so that it is easier to write. It will be a tremendous help. So here, I will be using this question as my example for a short writing task. It says, if you could learn how to do something new, what would it be and why? Use specific details to explain your choice. And as you can see here, there is space below to write your rough notes. This is the response I wrote. If I could learn to do anything, it would be to program software. Computers and phones are only growing in demand as new technology is being invented. This shows that programming is an important part of society and why I would choose it to learn as a skill. As you can see, it follows the point proof comment shown in the highlights. And here are some tips on writing your answer. Oops. On to multiple choice grammar questions. There will always be at least one, at least, sorry, one trick question which uses words such as not. Before selecting answers that say all or none of the above, which commonly appear at the bottom, read all your options. Never leave a multiple choice question blank. There's a 100% chance that we will get it wrong. Here's an example of what you will see in multiple choice grammar questions, as well as their answers. Number three is a qu trick question containing not. Finally, here are some strategies. And that will do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed, as well as picked up some useful information to help you prepare for the OSSLT. Bye.